Hello friends, Eric here. Say, starting this Sunday, July 5, we're going to have the option for in-building worship once again. And I want to help you get familiar with how we are going to come in and leave the building. So here are our doors, A through F, and we want you to come in through the gathering area doors, doors A and F. We don't want people coming in through door B, the office door, nor C, nor D, or E. So just stick with doors A and F. So as you approach the doors, there'll be some markers set up. And what we want you to do is just keep some space the group in front of you and um, keep some social distance. But then when you come up there, there'll be somebody there to welcome you. Hello. They'll be very friendly. So when you come in, what we want you to do is come immediately into the closest door and enter the sanctuary. In this case, just the first aisle to the right here. Just kind of come right in. We do not want you to use the middle doors. Okay, so just come in the first available door. Same thing again here on the other side, here to the left and proceed down the aisle. Now, at the end of the aisle, there'll be somebody there to help seat you. They are going to direct you to a pew as you come down. And what we want you to do is once you're directed toward a pew, come and sit all the way at the end of that row. So come all the way to the end. Same thing on the other side. If there is a group already in that row, just keep a nice six foot gap or leave some space. Again, here on the other side, once you find a pew, all the way down, and you'll be in really good shape. Okay, the sanctuary will proceed to fill in that fashion. When the sanctuary is filled, um, also, uh, do not uh, come by the mailboxes and the welcoming center will all be removed, so that won't be an issue. Anyway, there'll be rows of chairs in the gathering area, and what we want you to do is come down the mailbox side. And you're going to come down, somebody will direct you toward a row, and again, you're just going to head all the way down the row. Now, when the gathering area is full, we're going to have chairs set up in the activity center. So again, same situation, you'll proceed all the way down. Somebody will direct you toward a row of chairs. Come on down to the end. Now, again, if there's somebody seated in that row already, just leave a leave like a three chair space there. Just leave a nice little gap. Now, when the activity center becomes full, somebody will direct you down the hall here up to either the stairs or the elevator and you can come up to the summit and come on down, down the aisle, and find a row in that way. Now, a couple of additional notes. The child care center, the nursery, will not be attended. They're not, will, will not be child care. However, if you have a child who's crying or you need to just get away, that space will be open for you to come. We will have the worship service broadcast into that area as well. So you can find a place there to be with your little one if need be. Now, when we exit, We'll just do this in kind of reverse fashion. There'll be somebody there to dismiss your aisle. The sanctuary gathering area and activity center will proceed outdoors A or F. Just wait until you are given the signal to leave. Also in strategic places, there will be offering boxes. If you'd like to stop and place an offering there, there'll be convenient for you just as you proceed down you can place your offering there and we will exit the summit in the same way and the summit will exit out the office door door b and we will be good to go thanks so much goodbye